what is your experiences you faced uh, when you are joined when you joined as a in a new company three players of experience how project is described to you how do you start initiation doing task yeah the people who are, who are with some experience and but they don't have enough knowledge okay then you should handle things very carefully okay so first of all what is the project about the, all the kt documents if all the consultants are leaving at six o'clock or five thirty, you spend till nine o'clock to understand the kt documents because most of your colleagues are available in office you can ask two three questions to them compared to asking in whatsapp or something okay and if you are showing more interest you have to work more understand the kt documents and take the scenarios and practice in the quality system to understand better any questions you can ask if a person observed the senior or somebody has observed that this person is putting more efforts to understand the issues to practice and to go going through the kt documents definitely they will give you the enough support you are also leaving at 5 30 6 o'clock like an experienced consultant knowledgeable consultant and you are also going uh, spending weekend completely for roaming and all but expectation is you wanted to have a similar kind of output how can you get that if you're spending seven hours per day you have to spend 10 or 11 hours in initial two three months later you can come down to nine nine hours later you will become a normal seven hours working so that is the one thing and second thing you should understand the what kind of tickets the old tickets take last two months or three months of mm tickets if you're joined as support consultant what kind of tickets are being coming and how, whether you're able to understand how the solution is given what kind of solution is given to that tickets so go through the old tickets you can go to the tool you have access to your support tool you can go to the module mm you can filter last three months tickets which are resolved you can see the what solution is given those things if you are not understanding you go to the quality and practice ask questions when you're asking questions you should think sometimes maybe may, too much silly also you may ask but try to avoid it because try to google try to check any uh, the sap documents any blog or youtube channel anything so still if you're not getting then you can ask it so these are the the persons with less knowledge joined uh with a good package or with good experience and all then you should do all this groundwork you should generate the trust by the project manager that this person is putting a lot of efforts to enhance the skills spending daily more time daily more time also not required okay if you're spending more time the quality of time you have to spend to understand to practice to go through the old tickets how the tickets are how the p2 tickets are there how the p1 tickets are there how p3 tickets are there Okay, what solution is given how the communication given by your senior consultant the, how the email communication is being happened okay any appreciation somebody is getting you can follow their tickets how the resolving how the feedback is given by the users so these are the things you have to understand and a yeah, few more things where the printer is how to take a printer okay and if you get an authorization issue or anything who is the point of contact from basis team get the contact and keep it in your notebook or yeah, you keep an excel sheet for the list of pacs who is the pac for sd who is the pac for mm if you are mm if you are yeah, fico who is the pac for basis if you get any printer or laptop issue who is the pac from the help desk team okay how to access the printer okay those these things and all you have to learn don't do the uh, basic mistakes which will be uh, annoying when you do that one okay to whom you have to report okay and you are asking you need some printer problem send an email to your manager by keeping two you avoid such kind of things who is the printer help desk okay who is the help desk team and maybe you can copy in your manager so that they can fast and they can speed up the work if you directly send a normal email they may maybe they may delay so if you are keeping a manager in copy okay if you're asking something information to the other department keep your manager in copy wherever it is required Sometimes it may go for ego issues also. Why are keeping everything for, to your manager? So these are all very sensitive things. I cannot say which is correct or which is wrong. But as, but what I can say according to my experience, if you keep manager and copy wherever it is required to get, wherever you need a speed response, you can keep it. Not for all things you keep it and make other people to struggle. Okay, why this guy is always keeping manager? They will be hurry, hurry, right? If that is not that much urgent, so why is 
looping everyone in loop so these kind of uh, things may happen so these are all like uh, relation with other departments those things you need to handle so first of all you should know what is your project about what kind of issues are being received and who are the pacs and what are the equipment you are going to handle printer or um, or any laptop or any kind of other systems you are handling so how to who are the PSC if you get issue to whom you have to contact okay if you get any health related who is the health department okay who is the medical department who is the finance department to check it so these things you just come to know and the uh, travel policies a uh, timesheet so these things also you have to know, know better so to give a proper thing otherwise everywhere if you are doing silly mistake forgetting timesheet entry some people will forget timesheet entry and they will say that i forgot to enter timesheet so how can you forget your timesheet when you are coming daily okay so these kind of uh, mistakes you have to avoid uh, 